ब्रॉड टू यू बाय प्रोबो ऐसे ही हाँ और ना का गेम है प्रोबो द पावर ऑफ यस एंड नो द एक्टिविटी ऑन दिस प्लेटफॉर्म मे बी हैबिट फॉर्मिंग ऑफ फाइनेंशियली रिस्की पार्टिसिपेट रिस्पॉन्सिबली सो ज्वाइनिंग मी इज जॉन्टी रोड्स एंड दिस टाइम ही इज इन अ डिफरेंट रोल यू नो बट डू यू थिंक यू नो बीइंग एन एम्बेसडर इज द टफेस्ट टास्क और बीइंग अ कोच is the you know is a tough task that's a very good question uh, um, i haven't done many roles as a as a brand ambassador for a league because i'm still quite active and and if it's if you're a coach you're still involved with the game and you, you obviously you know you i run fielding practices and i'm hitting balls and catching balls so it's going to be interesting for me to sit on the side and actually watch and encourage the players i'm not too sure i might be jumping around a backward point once or twice in the game and remember hold on jonty different role get off the field give other people the chance right so let's talk about you know cricket in particular especially you know uh, since you you are in the ecosystem of indian cricket for very long time and you uh, you know absolutely understand that what exactly is going on in indian cricket so as per you do you think that uh, india's cricket is in transition mode in terms of you know having a separate team in t20s and you know few players are also playing in odis and also in test cricket so your thought on that Well India is a is a one country that I think had three teams playing international cricket at the same time. I mean they Shikhar he just retired but he had a team in Sri Lanka and you know that there're not many teams that can do that. I know Australia for a long time when Ricky Ponting was the captain Australia and and Steve Waugh Australia could play Australia A and feel like they were the number 1 and number 2 teams in the world and and I think India have got to a situation where the talent that you see coming through which is which is great amazing with this this corporate cup because there is so much talent in India so I think from a point of view where in in T20 50 over and 5 day cricket they are always at the top of the table I think just shows you the strength of the depth in this amazing country and and giving more players the opportunity to, to expose their skills um is what india is all about and i think we've certainly seen the benefits of the ipl and hopefully the pcl does the same you are part of lsg and uh, we have seen you know the kind of growth in terms of you know showing their skills in uh, recent times in couple of ipls association of zahir khan with lsg do you feel that it is going to you know impact give us such impact that uh, what exactly the lsg is thinking to have in their you know cup board that ipl trophy uh, that will be you know uh, a huge uh, association and uh, a build up for this event well zack's been around for a really long time and that's not said disrespectfully because in in a situation where he's seen it as a player he's sat on the side you know from a coaching point of view and was some of the best franchises around um you know he has the own his own experience and and technical skills that made him one of the premier swing bowlers in in world cricket because that's what you know we we've seen there's been some exciting fast bowlers that come out during the IPL young indian fast bowlers but you need the skill that goes with that too because if you just got pace and that's what zack has i mean he 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 brings incredible technical skills to the party and also a very wise head and and a calm demeanor and and i think you you know in in a in a 10 week sort of period of intense cricket where win lose play travel you just need calm heads in the dugout and and i know he's going to bring real value to the lsg setup when gotham left what was the mood be like in the camp well i think you know it's, it's a part of cricket we people come in they leave um no franchises or sorry not no franchises there've been one or two that have kept sort of staff in for a very long time so it, it wasn't a case of oh you know now the how we're going to plug this gap I mean he was a great guy to have around he was very competitive he was was useful to have when when KL pulled his his quad really badly and and then was out so a real assistance for Cronell when when Cronell took over the captaincy so he he adds again tremendous value we've seen what he's done and and now with a national setup he's going to do the same so it's you don't have voids that there is so much talent available these days that somebody brings something unique but you've got other people who bring something else to the game and and i think it's a it's a matter of finding what gels as a team and what gels as a unit and, and what brings out the best in everybody so yeah he was he was great to have around and certainly said when when we lost him and, and and he left but he's now moved on to something bigger and better too so bigger and better i mean he's certainly done everything as a player and and, and already as a coach so exciting to see for him what he does with the indian team would you like to join him again i mean <laughs> if there is an opportunity to you 
Well, they are a busy team, the, the, the national side. You know, players get occasionally to pick which tour they want to go on, but the coaching staff pretty much goes on every single tour. My friend Mornay Morkel is, yes, is heading there. So yeah. he's, I think it might be a lot thinner when he's finished with working with the Indian side because he spends a lot of time training in the hotel just to kind of get the frustrations out. So, so he's, he's got a couple of years ahead of him where he's going to do a lot of training. Not because he'll be frustrated, but he'll be in, in a hotel environment and he likes to work out. So wish Mornay and, and the Indian team... Um, under Gigi, all the very best. Last couple of questions, uh, Jonti. Uh, you know, there are talks going on about KL Rahul. Mr. Goenka, he has also not opened up, you know. I mean, it is a future of uh, kind of discussion. But your thoughts, I mean, is he going to be there? Or is there any, you know, discussion? What exactly is going on? Well, that's a, the, the, the one big advantage of being the fielding coach. You don't get into those discussions and you're not privy to the, you know, to the conversations that's happening. So those sort of meetings, uh, I, I read about them in social media or in the press. So I don't sit in those meetings. Thank goodness. <laughs> Thank you so much. Join Kijiu Sports the Cup Telegram channel. Where experts will give you fantasy picks. You'll get exclusive content and the best updates. Your game level is only sports tak ke saath